Just wait! Don't you know I'm the Black Kirchhoff, Lao Te? I'm a Hoysai fighter. Try your best to fight me. Don't block my way. Nonsense! I can see you may be good with your sword. Let's find the place and have a good fight. Huh. You'll die in a minute. You... God damn you! feel hungry, just help yourself. Mm. You're a native here. Mm. Where's your home? On the other side of the hill. Where are you going? To Fan Yang. The prostitute's home. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. <clears throat> Stop. How much you want for just one girl? <laughs> just don't bother, not your business. I ask you, how much is it? <laughs> it's quite expensive. Five hundred. <laughs> That's ten times my traveling expenses. What? Want to buy her back? <laughs> you grew up together. You must want her back now. Ah, uh, I understand your feelings. When I was about your age, the girl I loved was being sold. It drove me mad. I felt really sad at the time. And that's why I started this job. I admire the rich, despise the poor. Uh, all these years, life is getting difficult. I think it's very clear to you. I'm sorry. You better take it easy. Wait up. <laughs> if you want to seize her back, you can never succeed. Huh. I didn't want to seize her back until you said so. But now I've changed my mind. <laughs> so you're unhappy with what I told you. You can't seize her because you're unhappy. You're right. Don't be so silly. Come on and get what you want now. You'll regret those words. But I'm not that easy going. Let me teach you a good lesson. <laughs> Bastard! <laughs> 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 
You're too mean. Just like whores. You're the type of man that ought to be taught. You can't escape! Uh, you can't escape! Uh... Don't follow me. I'm sorry. I think that you are no ordinary warrior. Your sword skill is really terrific. It's not that good. I am the soldier of the army, Wang Yim. This is my son, Wang Ho. And you, what's your name? Han San. Ah. The lizard's poisonous, and you can stand it. That's really fantastic. I'm used to living in the wilds all these years. <sighs> you don't feel itchy. It needs great patience. That's maybe the reason why your sword's so good. Aho, uh -oh, you must try to learn from this uncle and keep your patience. Yes. Have you come here for tomorrow's combat? Will you stay here? Right. I came for it. I've come for the combat too. Tomorrow I'll try my luck. But if I am killed, this poor child will become an orphan. And this combat will be the very last chance for an old man like me. If I lose, do me a favor, please. Take care of him. given birth to us. Now for this combat, we'll fight for our lives. You may win it or lose it. The regulations. Any wound or death, both sides cannot complain. I hope that you can do well so that the best man can be the winner. <laughs>
Today's combat will end now. We'll continue tomorrow. <laughs> You should have your fight later, but now you're disqualified because you helped others. Mighty Sword, what do you think? It's something he deserves. What a damn fool. There was no need to fight. Hmm. Silly fool. I don't regret it. 
I'm a real swordsman. House. Don't be silly. This sword's gonna stay with me forever. Huh? So you mean you won't stay with me? Uh, sorry. Don't get jealous of the sword. Uh. Hmm. Just now in the inn, someone wanted to buy that sword. Why didn't you sell it? I don't understand. Uh, I'll tell you that. I mixed my life up with this sword. The sword's full of my sense. I can have it only once in my life. I've already sold the cover to make ends meet. Aren't you satisfied? If I were you, I'd sell it and save money. People who use the sword are ambitious and build their success on others' pain. <laughs> Come on, you're getting jealous of the sword. Nonsense. Uh, uh, sorry, but that's too much to ask for. Huh. How can you speak like that? I only want to build a little house, somewhere where we can live our lives peacefully together. That's all I long for. The idea of fortune is different between us. A fine house, two children, good husband. It's all I want. I'll be satisfied. I... Shut up! Why the hell am I leaving hometown? I left because I want to build up my business. Don't you remember? In our town, I was looked down on. Eh, so then I went outside. You were willing to follow me. You should be aware of that. We will have children later on. You fool. Fortune is that you're with me. Don't cry, I do know that. No one can save you if you die. No one can kill you if you live. <laughs> Heaven ain't no place for you, and hell is your home. We will kill whoever we meet. When you meet us, you're really gonna die. Oh, <laughs> 
All of you kneel. Oh, yeah, 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 Uh, what's your name? It's late at night, and I want to buy something from you. Uh, you are? Could you be that? Your sword is the great heartless sword. I want it. Please sell it. Uh, I'll never sell it. Uh, uh. You have no right to choose. Huh? What? Huh. You're a swordsman? That's right. Buying the sword is better than stealing it. And so, you have no right to choose. <coughs> when you were in the inn, you nearly got yourself killed. If I didn't want to buy it, I wouldn't have saved you. <sighs> and that means I owe you something now. I hope you'll understand. Huh. Your name? Hansan. Huh. But you know it yourself. You're not really saving me. You'll soon know the truth. Time will be the judge. Then you'll know. Why is that? I have a major combat. In order to win over the games, I must be armed with the greatest sword in this world. What's the major combat? I'll go challenge Dragon. Huh? Uh, uh, you are only dreaming. Uh, 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 uh. Dragon's the best swordsman that we've ever had. Uh, you're no match for the famous swordsman. Uh, I think you've never seen his face. Uh. I planned it all out. You have? You'll know about it. After the battle. Uh, uh. That's good. I'll wait and see. Now that i found that we're alike, uh, that we're both famous. Sorry, get me the famous heartless sword. I want to sell it to my friend. Huh. What's the matter with you? Hey, look at this silly guy. I think he's crazy. Yeah, he wants to be famous. You know he'll be turned down, so he comes to challenge him. Right. Ooh, to challenge Dragon? Ooh, it's dangerous. <laughs> It's dangerous. Huh? Who is the swordsman? Do you know the swordsman? Uh, yeah. He's from my village, the son of the master. Do you know his name? It's Sun Kan Tong. I now see our son's plan. We must set up the signboard. Hmm, that's terrific. It's really hard to imagine. Hmm, Hansen, he thinks it through, but he may neglect one thing. It's important to fight Dragon. He has to fight with all his warriors. Sahi, is Sun Kam Tong the first man you loved? I. Uh, huh? Well, I. Uh... <sighs> it's a fact. 
I was forced. Don't lie to me. No matter what, you, you still love that man. I know I must be right about it. That you can't forget that man. You must be thinking of him. Since you met him, you forgot me. It's not true. I, I hate that man. Don't say I'm thinking of him. So he, you know that? I'm not that easy going. I'm getting jealous. My breast. When you were looking at me just now, it's so soft. That guy must be your first man. I didn't want it. I was forced. It's the same. It's not the same. There's a difference between love and rape. I, at that time, I fainted. He... Uh, no matter. It's rape for other reasons. A woman can never forget her first man. You stupid! Uh, you know, whenever I think of this matter, my temperature rises. Come and feel me. My hands are getting hot. Oh, chat, let it be. We must be on our way. No. I must come to pieces. I know that he is your first man, so how can I let him go? There's only one man who has the right to be with you in this world. Don't be so silly. I beg you, forget about it. I know it now. I can't forget it. Oh, chat, the mighty sword of Cam Tong is the best in this whole world. You are. Ah. Oh, chat, beat me if you feel good. Come on and hit me. Disgusting. I must kill that man. Oh, chat. Oh, chat. Oh, Whose followers? Don't pretend. Sun Kam Tong. I won't pretend. I have too many enemies to count them all. I just don't know them one by one. Do you mean you fool so many people and they've all become your foes? The miss has killed herself now. We must take revenge! Miss? Oh, right. You mean Ma Su Ying? Huh. You must know. I didn't want that girl. She seduced me and wanted me. Women are fond of heroes. And she admired me, the best swordsman. The fighters of your home are not my match. You must know that it's she who wanted to love me. And that means she was forced to kill herself by your fighters. Huh. You want to kill me now? Now why don't you think about it first? Remember, if you can kill me, then it's all right. But I'm afraid you'll lose your life. That's not a joke. Don't talk nonsense. Hey, man, are you going to leave your body behind here? Scattered in this wild place? To feed the birds? Don't try to escape from us. <laughs> you must have a wrong idea about my kung fu. It is good enough to kill any of you men here. This world is full of silly fools. If I use my sword, in a second, all of your heads will be cut off. Don't be naive to think that you can kill me here. <laughs> I'm fond of fighting, but I don't like to fight with those below average fighters. I have no interest. Therefore, if you think you can't fight me, you can leave now. I won't kill any man for no reason. I pity all those fools, I won't kill them. <laughs> you must be aware of my kung fu. All of you are no good stuff. None of you can be her husband. You must all know this fact, so you become annoyed and come to look for death. Huh. If it's like that, you are too silly. I have one thing to remind you. Among all the women that I have made love to, she is the meanest. <laughs>
Why are you doing it? I won't tell you that. My name's Empty. I am the monk who used to live over at the Autumn Hill. And my kung fu is the best. Oh. <laughs> Do you want to practice it so you can challenge Dragon? Hmm. Good boy. But most of them think that you know that Dragon won't accept the fight, so you challenge him publicly. What do you think about that? I'll beat him. I have confidence. But when you cut the bamboo, it seems that you're really frightened. It's for fun. For fun? <laughs> if it's for fun, you shouldn't do it. What should I do? Huh. You are really... <laughs> I think this is the first time that you have ever come to town. You, since you arrived, hmm, I think you haven't done anything important. I've seen all the big buildings in town. They're real good. <laughs> Rubbish. All the buildings are just unmovable. They are not good looking. I tell you that, what you gotta know is the girls living in town. Did you ever embrace them? <laughs> It seems that you haven't thought of such things at all. Or else you are afraid of the one you'll challenge. You're frightened. But I can tell you, if you want it, go and do it. Or you'll miss a lot. When you have reached an old age, you have no time to regret it. If you think that to have a woman would weaken you, you are far from the level of the best swordsman. Hey, I'll lead you to have some fun. Why tell me to do such things? <laughs> there goes an old saying that, if you don't want it, don't force the others. Are all monks like you? Talk about women and do such things? Actually, that's all right. We are monks. We are men. I think there's nothing wrong. Others may advise you to do good, to help the others, not to have girls. And then you'll win. But in my opinion, the winners would take it all. If you'll be the king, you understand it. From now on, so as to be the best Swordsman in this world, you have to undergo a challenge and forsake a lot. The best must solve problems in order to be great. Really, I tell you, the fact that you chose Dragon to be your start, huh, I do admire you. It's one of the best ways to make it to the top. If you are sure you can beat him, just show me what's the kung fu that you've learned. Maybe I can help, though I don't know what Dragon will think about it. I know my advice on him is effective. He and I are good friends. I can try my best to advise him to accept, but whoever will win, you must not injure. And before that, I have to know your kung fu. All right? Let's drink the wine. Hmm. I am an old customer here, and for more fun, we must enjoy ourselves together. <laughs> you must join in with me, then. I have to take part. <laughs> <laughs> you can show your ability. Uh, what do you have in mind? If you want to do it. You can go and do it yourself. <laughs> we are just two good old friends. <laughs> I drink this cup of wine to you. Yeah, I'll drink to that. 
Mister, what can I do for you here? Right. It's high time that you should enjoy it with me. Yes. Beautiful. How long have you been here? Can you tell me? It's been three years. You've been working as a prostitute? Yes. You started upon arrival. I was a servant first. If you've had a man every night, then you must have had hundreds of men until now. What's your name? Su Chun. Huh? I only want you to tell me your true name. I could. At first, I should have kept you at the old place. Then you could have gotten away from all those men. But now that's too late. I'm sorry. Though I've wandered around. I remember the good old days. I think I'll never do those things again. Seeing you like this, I feel sorry. It's my first time to such a place. You're not Akut. You're the prostitute, Su Chun. Uh, please forgive me. Please forgive me. Please forgive me. Please forgive me. Please forgive me, please forgive me, please, please. You must you be must a native. Be a native. Mm. Where's your home? The other side of the hill. Come, let me embrace you. Remember the taste of fried chicken? Yes, yes. Did it taste good? Yes. I really hope that I could have been your first man. Yes. But you are much too young. Yes. I have one thing I want you to do. Yes, yeah, sure. If I ever die, please bring my bones to my hometown. Throw them to the sea. Thanks a lot. Yeah. Hansan. Akut. Can the monk be now? I'm Dragon. I know. Ten years ago, I was hurt by you. 
on the chest. Eh? Ten years? You know that messenger who was hurt by you when sending the challenge note. I know. I know. What can I call you now? Han San. It's indeed you. Maybe a surprise to find me here. Eh, I've come to visit the monk, empty. I don't know where he is. I'm glad to meet you. I'm so happy. As to the challenge, please accept it. That day after I was hurt by you, I was thrown to the door like a little dog. I told myself, I must kill you one of these days. So promise me, you have to accept it. I'm sorry about it. I won't accept it. Why not? I plan to give up my sword. I've come here to discuss this with Empty. But why do you do that? In thinking of all the things that I've done, in my heart, there's loneliness. And I know I cannot be a swordsman at all. I don't get you. Please give up your wish to fight me. If I could fight with him, I'm sure I would beat him. You treating the bamboo as dragon? I wouldn't do that. I have seen dragon lately. Do you know why dragon accepted the fight? You want to know the reason? Reason? Could it have been your advice to him? Oh, no. Dragon has a lovely woman. She has been kidnapped by someone with her child. There's a letter signed by Han San saying, if he will not promise to fight with you, the woman and her newborn child will be killed. Rubbish. I'm not such a big fool. I wouldn't do such a thing so as to force him to challenge me. You believe that I would do that? Of course not. No matter what, no matter who did it. Now that Dragon has promised to fight you, the fight must be held one day. Before this thing is cleared, the fight should be postponed. Hmm. Too late. Tomorrow you'll fight. He and you. Who will be the winner? I think you know it better. He knows it too. But under such circumstances, you must not injure. This would be possible. I think you'll do it. I'd never do such a mean thing, so as to force you to fight me. Just let it be. I will know it. But you are so late here. I slept here yesterday night. Good. Let's start our fair fight now.
Hold it. It seems that you have won. But I think you are not the winner. Dragon is too tired. He has no plan. What I mean is, before the fight, he'd already given up. So your triumph doesn't mean a thing. You must have seen it too that he had given up. So you didn't hurt him. This is good. It may be because you have a gentle character. You are so lenient. But you have done it wrong. In combat, there's no way that a swordsman will renounce his fight would be treated so leniently. Oh, I know you're a Sun Kum Tung. I'm Ho Chat. I want to have a fair fight with you. Come. <clears throat> you're just feeling too excited. You don't really want to fight. There must be a reason. Ask yourself. For those who hate me, just can't count them all. Maybe you can tell me, so that I can recall it. You remember you raped a little girl named So He. So He. The daughter of your servant. Huh. I made love to too many girls, not only just one. I'm sorry that I don't know her. I just can't recall it. <laughs> Bastard! You are the meanest thing in this world. You've raped my wife and you forgot it. I won't let you go on living. I must kill you today. Ho oh, Chet, I will fight with you, but there's one thing. What's that? Your wife must be somewhere around. What about it? Just call her here to be a spectator. Why's that? If I win again, I'll make love to her. Bastard! You. So he! Let me have a look at you! So I'll refresh my memory! Uh, uh, bastard! So he! Oh, chat. Now that I'm the winner, you've promised me. I'll take your wife now. See you later. My God, so he... Don't be sad, just let it be. You're nonsense. So he is my wife. I love my wife, and she loves me. You can't succeed if you've got a woman with you. So he would never come back to me again. If she's being insulted again. She won't go on living then. Just don't think about that. You'll be okay. I'll feel no good in my life. The bloody silly fool. He'll hurt her. Uh, 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 I feel too painful. I just can't stand it. Uh, uh. So he. So he. So he. Where are you now? So he. Uh, 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 so he. <laughs> What's the matter? Don't touch me. What? I don't like such a husband. So he, could it be that you like your first man and you don't love me? Nonsense. You're a coward. Coward? Worse than a coward. Hm. You just watched your wife being taken away. Coward! So he, you were seized and raped by that man. Don't blame me. I was not raped. But that man won't let you go. Believe me. You won't cheat me? Don't you believe me? Really haven't. You're too suspicious. <laughs> Good. If you really haven't, let me have a look. You. Well, maybe tonight. <laughs> 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 Master, it's, it's time, time now. But what is the time now? It's almost noon. 
So the time hasn't come yet. There's still time left. But you gotta prepare. I will proceed to the battleground directly. I need sleep. Don't bother me. Don't disturb me again. Don't worry about me. I need to sleep for a while. Just leave me alone. Master! Master. Why are you so foolish? I know I'll win. I'm different from my brother. Kung Fu, skill, they are different. Besides, my sword is unique in this world. It's good. Later on, you can watch how I will defeat Han San and break him into two. You understand me? Now leave me. Yes, yes master. master. I will defeat him. Where's your home? The other side of the hill. I know Honsan will win. What is it? <laughs> hey, why steal my sword? Who paid you to steal it? Speak! Tell me! Hans Sam will defeat you. Tell me, who did it? I'll forgive you. Or else, you'll die. Speak! Why did you do it? Tell me or I'll kill you. Speak! Tell me! What's going on? What's going on here? Just wait, I paid her to do it. So it's you? You did it for Hans Sam? Never. It's for no one. But I must admit, Hansan and I are two good friends. You must know that. You are so famous. All of us know you are indeed the best fighter. It's for fairness that I plan to take away your famous sword from you. This girl is innocent. Please forgive her. That's good. If you want to take Hansan's place, that's all right. Just draw your weapon out now. The time has almost come for you to fight with Han San. And now, you want to fight with me? This is Light Sword. You know where I come from? I'm from Autumn Hill. I'm the best. Not even you can beat me in a fight. There's no time. Better hurry. All right. If you want me to teach you, I'll get my sword. Are you all right, my child? So pitiful. I'm sorry. It's, in fact, my fault. Get up. All right. I'll take you out. Dirty Mug, you come on. What does it matter? This is not a place for crying. Uh-uh. <laughs> 
Please don't cry. Dry all your tears now. Yes. You go. You as well? <laughs> I must go too. Go? Huh. It's Han Sang's job to kill Tiger. If I kill Tiger now, he'll be angry. There's nothing he can do. What can we do? <laughs> Actually, this is a pretext. I have no confidence to beat that bloody guy. The best way is for us to escape here. That won't be easy. He's not easy going. This, this girl has been hurt by you. Don't worry. Don't be ashamed. Tiger, we must delay him. But there's no way. He has drawn out his sword for you. Dirty mud, you come out. I know you need talking skill in your job, and I think you can delay him. No matter what happens, go. Dragon's followers, we'll take revenge for him. Hansan, you better surrender right now. 
may I advise you all not to waste your life without reason. We, we must kill you! you! that you can defeat the mighty sword. You dirty fool. You've killed so many lives already. You've dirtied this well. <laughs> may I guess it now that you are taking revenge for your teacher. We want to remind you that you are dirty. You will be killed. So you hide away in order to live. We did that for you. We were planning to kill you. We've been following you all these days. You shouldn't do that. No matter how thorough you plan to kill me, you will be added to my long list of those I have killed. All the dirty men in this world cannot live long. It is the rule. <laughs> Let's have a showdown today. Let's fight now.
Chat. Who? Where is Han Sang? Hmm. I know he's afraid of me. He can't fight my mighty sword. Uh, it's not that. He has accepted your challenge. He needs the practice to defeat you. He has come to the point. And he has told me before. He wants you to think it over. I'm not afraid. Mind you, you'll be killed. <laughs> I won't be killed. I'll defeat him. Hey, 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 give me my clothes, hey, my clothes, uh, bastard, uh, uh, bastard. Why do you keep silent? Is there anything wrong? I was thinking. You will succeed. Perhaps you are the unbeatable. In two more days, I'll fight that Sun Canton. You are unbeatable. He is the best swordsman. The fight cannot be avoided. I must win. I want to win, and I will win. If you want to live, you'll live. If you want to win, you will win. I'm certain of that. I have confidence. To know your foe is important. You are hard on practicing and using the bamboo as a sword. You've reached another stage. Your mind is now purified. That's right. Uh, but there's different ways of practice for every swordsman. Some do it at sea, some practice it on the hill, and some at home. Like you, using bamboo is one of the ways. Some try to kill birds. I've heard Ho Chat say this, why don't you try it? No, I've never tried it. But knowing how the birds fly isn't that complicated. They must stick to some rules. All we have to do is see how they fly, and how they glide, and then kill them, with swords. That isn't something too difficult. If we know what the rules are, even if we're very slow, we can kill the bird. That's easy. And that means you can kill the birds too? Perhaps. Your fight with Han San is to take place tomorrow. Have you informed him? He chose the time. I choose a place. You must win it. It's to decide who will be the best, you know. I will kill him for your father. I will defeat him. If I fulfill his wish, what I need is 1,000 tails. You're greedy. It seems that you just don't worry that you could be killed by him. <laughs> These past five years of my life, I've traveled around. I've encountered many good swordsmen. They're all killed within one shot. And your sword, I think it is one of the finest. You can read the sword. I think I can. Want to take a look? Good. This sword is nameless, but it's real fantastic. Made by the Khan couple, and this is the last sword they made. Don't you believe that swords bear a look? Tell me. What do you think about it? Does it bring harm? If you don't mind me, when I first saw this sword, I could feel the devil's power in it. Oh, please tell me then. All swords can be classified in several ways. The very first part 
let's start from the marks on it. Swords are made differently, and different marks would appear on it. There are sun marks, moon marks, earth marks, and the top part bears three stars. One represents tranquility and peace on earth. The other two, one brings disaster, one illness. The middle, if it has three scars, that means harm, and the holder will meet an accident in his life. The bottom, if there's a scar, that means death. What more, if the scar appears on it, it's the worst. He cannot get away. You have no way to choose but to die if the sword has one. That scar is most harmful. It's the devil's wish. No one can prevent it. You must beware. <laughs> Sasal, I think all the scars that you've mentioned do appear on the sword of the enemies whom I have encountered. And that means all of them are to be defeated by their own sword. You have described, and I know it, I can turn all the bad luck to my foes, and that I can make use of it to defeat Han. And I think after I have killed Han San by using this sword, and it may turn bad. If it is true, after the fight with Han San, the sword will bear a scar. And I will give it to you, so you'll destroy it. It'll be all right. As to that 1,000, I will ask it from your dad. You can get it after the fight.
Sun Kem Tom. Your mighty sword has lost. What do you mean? No need to fight. I know the result already. Huh. There's no use. You want to make me annoyed. Listen. If you are able to use your sword to defeat me, you won't throw away the scabbard to the sea. And you must know that. You can't fight me. You'll be killed at once. And we sword? When I first saw the sword, I could feel the devil's power. practice to succeed. It's all over now. All is settled. Oh, Jack, huh? didn't you tell me that you would follow Han San back home? Uh, uh, right. I've told you that. <laughs> go. Let's go follow him. That's the truth. We should follow. If we go against it, even if we have done everything, that would fail in the end. We will suffer for what we've done, so we must behave good. But in this world, not everyone can stick to the rules as a good man. Finally, they'll suffer. We are all born good. If we are good, we will live long and be rewarded by God to live it well, so man must behave good to achieve peace and harmony.